And so it would be that the humble gamer would play more Skyrim. You never asked for it, but you'll get it anyway. Hello, everyone. This is the Humble Gamer, and you might feel this is a bit familiar. Well, that's because this is Skyrim, and if you've uh, if you've not been following me too much, or you haven't looked back on my channel, you'll notice, uh, or you might not have noticed, I already did a video on this game. Um, sorry about the muck up with my sentence there. But yeah, I have already done videos on this game, but you know what? I did it on the PC, and as much as I love the infinite capabilities of the PC, I thought it would be so much easier to record this game on the console, that I thought I'd come back and play this game again, but on my console, um, on the version that I have saved on my console. So, here I am, once again, going into the world of Skyrim. Uh, except this time, I have a character that is way into the game. Uh, we are talking way, way into the game. As you can see, he's only level 49. His name is Wolverine, and he's a mage. Um, I... I've done everything, I think, uh, on this save file. I've done Dawnguard, I've done Dragonborn, I've done the main quests, I've done the Thieves' Guild, I've done... Uh, oh, what's, what's the other one called? Um... <laughs> Uh, the the night mother I, I, I forget what it's called um, the, the blood gu guild thing I don't even know but yeah I've pretty much oh and, and I did the main uh, empire quest as well I sided with the storm cloak so that's you, you, you might notice that while we're playing but um but yeah this is Skyrim uh, and it's being really slow in loading um, I won't be showing any more loading screens during this recording. I just wanted to show that one there because it was a good opportunity to get some information out. But um, but yeah, here we go. This is my house in uh, Lake. This is Lakeview Manor. This is my main house. This is the one I chose to be my main house. Um, but this is the Nightingale, Lulu Lulu Lulin. I don't know his name. I have my trusty sidekick Uthgood. Uthgood the Unbroken. I'm still here. I'm glad you're still here, Uthgood. I'm glad. Um, Uthgood go. is uh, modelling some going. very lovely ebony male armour. Uh, let me just show you uh, what, what you she has on her. Uh, she is she, yeah, she has an, a superior ebony shield which blocks 37% of damage. She never uses it. One Daedra arrow because you only need to give your sidekicks in this game uh, one arrow when you give them a bow and they'll be able to just use it infinitely. Uh, so, otherwise she'll use like normal default iron arrows or, or whatever, with whatever bow you give her. So, but she's modelling some ebony mail here, which was a special item I got. Um, so she can, she can do things that no one else can do. I gave her this as well because this basically overpowers her as a sidekick. She can literally just kick ass. If she gets uh, hurt really badly, she summons like three... Uh, conjurations which just kick ass so she's l just unbeatable this this bitch uh, necklace of revival her health this actually does affect her health regeneration as an NPC so uh, but yeah she's got ebony boots as well which which I, I put some stuff on there so her one-handed would do more one-handed attacks focus quite a lot on on the damage she can deal and her her bow here does fire damage which basically means that she is an absolute badass so us good Uthgood, you are an absolute fucking badass, just saying. Um, so yeah, I've, I've done, I've done a lot of stuff in this game already. In fact, I think the, uh, yeah, I, I, I basically finished the Dragonborn main quest and I was going to start doing side quests on Solstheim. 
Um, I didn't actually decide what I was going to do before recording this, but I suppose I could go back to the Thieves Guild because I haven't fully restored the Thieves Guild yet. Um, I'll show you. I'll show you here. I actually do have the two black books from uh, uh, the main quest in uh, Solstheim. You can get more of them a uh, bit with the side quest, but I've got the two main ones here, uh, and then I've got the three older scrolls as well. So uh, that's good. But uh, but yeah. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, probably do a Thieves Guild quest or two and then go to Solstheim. So, spoilers, um, but yeah. Hmm, this gem looks quite interesting. I I can't quite make out what it is, though. It it It's very... look at it, look at it. Oh, it looks marvellous. Oh, look at it, it's shining. Shining in the light, look. Look at it. Look at it. Look. Look at this. Look at it. It looks great. Okay. Outside we are. Oh, bandits. Wonderful. Good opportunity to show you what I've got here. Um, I have two ebony swords. Oh, actually, no. These are Daedric swords, I think. Wait, what, what, what are these again? Oh yeah, these are Daedric Swords. Yeah, I have two Daedric Swords, one of Leeching, one of Blaze. Uh, basically, one does fire damage, one does health uh, damage. So, uh, one will actually suck the health out of enemies and the other will suck the... Uh, um, well, it won't... It'll burn them. <laughs> it'll burn the life out of them. Uh, so yeah, those are two very uh, incredible weapons to have on, on me. Uh, this guy has some Daedric Arrows in him. Oh, that's another thing as well. Um, the fact that I've given... Uh, Uthgood a Daedric arrow uh, she'll use those uh, because they're the most powerful arrow in her arsenal and um, and sometimes when she kills enemies with them you'll be able to pick them up off the enemies as well so you can basically get three free uh, powerful arrows out of her uh, by giving her just one arrow uh, which is really cool um, I don't know if she shot this one with any uh, no she didn't okay cool beans um, I have my own wagon and everything I don't need it though hey Lucia yes uh, I don't actually have anything for you, Lucia, so... Oh, thanks, Lucia. Thank you. Um, right. Okay, so we're going to go to the Thieves' Guild then, uh, I guess. Did you oh, hello. really build this house all by yourself? Wow. Well, th thanks for noticing, Blaze. Thanks for noticing that I spent, like, hours making this house look okay. Although, to be honest, it did actually take me about three hours when I got the Hearthfire DLC to build this house. Um, because I didn't really know how it all worked and I didn't really know like what anything was. I was going back through save points when I did that actually to uh, to see... Shut up, Blaze! Uh, to see how... Uh, like which things did what. Uh, so, but yeah. Let me go to the Thieves Guild. So it's over here. Thieves... Thieves Guild! Okay. Actually, actually you know what? Let's, let's just go straight to Solstheim. I, can't, I don't see no reason why not to, because I fucking hate the Thieves Guild anyway. The missions for them are really boring. Oh god, it's these weird dwarfish things. Oh god, look at them. Look at them. Ugh. Oh, you disgust me. You fucking disgust me. Ugh. If you're looking for passage, talk to Captain Gyalin. Oh. Gu guys, there was... There was no need to parrot each other, okay? Okay, I've got you, you're giving me hiccups with your parroting. Fuck you. <coughs> oh, fuck, I burped too. Yeah, shut up, you two. You weirdos. Huh? To the ground. Ash spawn like to spring up from nowhere. Huh, cool. Okay. I already solved the ash spawn mission anyway, so that's fine. Okay. Uh, as far as I remember, um, the... Next mission here, is, yeah, a new source of Star Rim. That's that's one of the missions I have to do here. Um, I don't actually know. Okay, that's up there. Uh, okay, let's start by going to Bodir Grove or Brodir Grove here. Banam, 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 banam. Each of Solstheim's sacred stones grants a power which can be used only once. Return to the stone to reacquire the power. I've got the power! Boom! Do you know what? I was really interested um, 
I'll take an opportunity to, to talk about this here. I was actually really, really interested in the lore of Skyrim. Like, obviously, as many people probably were, but I actually dug really deep into the lore, looked at YouTube videos, people were explaining it in full detail. I even went ahead and found some of the books to read the lore within the game as well. Um, oh, crap, these fucking dudes. Okay. Do you know what? I'm a mage. Why don't I show you my mage power? Here we go. I, I use uh, lightning because... Well, it's fucking fantastic. Look at it. Look at this guy. Down on his legs. Down on his fucking knees. What a guy. You too. Uh, hey, hey, hey. Don't, don't walk out of the way of my lightning. Don't walk out of the way of my lightning. How dare you. Wow. That's... That's an awkward position to die in. Oh, yeah. When she ducks, she, she does this. Look at that goes all shadow. That has to do with the ebony mail armor, I think. I still can't remember where I got that from, actually. Um, where, where are we here? Earth good. Piss off. I got loads of stuff here. Um, right. Oh, piss. Piss. Uh, we have to go up that way. Okay. Oh, God, you've got a chest here. I didn't even realize you had a chest here. Uh, flawless diamond. I'll take that. Oh god, yeah, because I did the uh, I did the Stones of Baron's Eye mission the other day, which is the first time I've done that in a long time. So now I'm finding like gems in every chest I look in, which is really cool. Oh, Heartstone, I need this. I need to collect this for a mission later. I haven't actually picked up the mission yet, but you need Heartstone for it. So I think you can actually learn to uh, form Heartstone into weaponry or something. I can't remember. Um, but there's Heartstone uh, veins all over this island, so... But yeah, carrying on talking about the... Uh, oh, wow. Scathe, uh, there's loads of it. Wow. Um, talking a little bit more about the lore, actually. That volcano over there is the Red Mountain. I, I honestly didn't know that much about the Elder Scrolls lore before Skyrim because I never got into Morrowind or Oblivion until I played Skyrim. So uh, when I looked into the lore behind the Elder Scrolls games, it really intrigued me, the entire sort of uh, world that's been built. I mean, like... There must be sort of a, a, a Elder Scrolls Bible in the Bethesda office that has like the entire law written out or something because, I mean, this is an intriguing and epic story through the eras that, you know, this game uh, seems to follow. I can't actually remember the space be of years between Oblivion and Skyrim. I, I think it's like several hundred years, I'm not sure. I honestly can't remember. But, um,. It is like a really long time between each of the games, so they do talk about the older games in this one, though. They they mention like the Oblivion Crisis and uh, and and there was something that happened in Morrowind. I can't remember, um, but yeah, I find it quite interesting that um, that Sol Solstheim you can actually view the Red Mountain from it, and of course on the PC version you can actually go to that Red Mountain by no clipping and uh, and it, there's not really anything there. Um, excuse me, are you bandits? Oh, you're soldiers? Whoa! Excuse me, bitch. Do you mind? Oh my god, seriously. Are you guys just... Are you guys avoiding my lightning or are you just really stupid? Seriously, what the hell is wrong with you guys? I don't even know. Is that... That's not Arthgood. Arthgood's down there being a badass shooting arrows. There you go. Well done, us good. Well done. You did right. Wow. See, us good knows what she's doing. She always knows what she's doing. Oh fuck! I've I've got to find a key on one of these fuckers. Great. What a wonderful day. Oh, there we go. Okay. A handwritten note. What does it say? I grow impatient with your lack of progress. If you cannot break the smith. I will be forced to find a more capable interrogator. I expect your next report to contain a more encouraging results. Or to contain more encouraging results. Well, Thalmor soldier, you have been murdered, so you cannot do anything. Um, let's go in here. Uh, and it's probably more caves. I, t I tend to rush through caves now in this game. I've gotten to a point with this character now where I don't really have to stop and like heal or anything. I can sort of just buzz through. Sometimes, like, especially on Solstheim, I've had to, like, stop because there's, like, crowds of enemies. Um, but other than that, though. 
Oh, look, a secret basement room. Like, that Please, hasn't been done before. Oh, no, it's not a basement room. By the owl maker. I, I, I hope you're here to release me. I am indeed, my friend. Outsider. I remember you. You're the one who freed the skull from the dark spell. I am indeed. The old maker that you have come. These accursed elves have taken me from my home. Hmm. Uh, why? I don't. Fuck it. I'll, I, I want to know. I know this word, Thalmor. But if you mean the elves, they were trying to learn the secrets of forging stalwart. Huh? Why do you call They're them elves, elves and everybody else calls them Thalmor? As a map. He says that it shows the location of a hidden source of Stalrim. Stalrim? What is Stalrim? Enchanted ice. As hard as iron and as cold as death. Stalrim can be forged into deadly weapons. But the art is known only to the smiths of the skull. Huh. They have a ship. They took me there and showed me the map. You will find it on the northern coast of the island. Oh, Please, wonderful. Do not let Ankarian make his weapons. Kill him or let him live. But take the map from him. It belongs with the skull. I will return to the village. Just, can I just point out that this guy actually looks like an utter badass? Like, let me just, let me just show his face here. Look at those eyes! Can you look up at me, Boulder? But Boulder? Boulder, are you okay? Don't die on me. Elves. I've never seen such greed and treachery in a creature before. He looks really badass. He's got the eyes of a beast. All right, come on, Uthgood. It's time to go. We've got to kick some ass on a ship or something. Um, let's do it. Let's go. Let's do the thing that he wants us to do. Oh, look, it's Mirak. I am Mirak. I am the first dragon born and the last. Not anymore, Mirach. I murdered your ass and I got your shout and your weapons and whatnot, which I've left at my house. Um, <laughs> I, di I didn't really want to use his weapons. I'm a mage, more or less, so I, I tend I tend to use specific uh, spells or weapons. Um, if I have to use physical weapons, it's always those Daedric swords because they kick ass. Um, and if I use magic, it's usually the chain lightning. Though I probably could find another uh, magic spell to use. In fact, which shout am I actually using right now? Because I need to make sure I keep a shout on me that's useful in case I'm in a hot spot. Uh, unrelenting for... Okay, no, that's stupid. I don't need that right now. Uh, soul tear is probably more useful. Um, actually, you know what? In case I run across a dragon, I'm going to use uh, Bend Will. Um, because I need to ride five dragons to get an achievement anyway, so... Okay, let me try and teleport to wherever it is I need to go here. He said it was on the north side of the island. Uh, there, right there. It would it would appear I have already been there. Okay. Yeah, it must have been on my rounds of Solstheim. When I first got here to do the, the DLC, I decided to do a round of the island to sort of check it out myself, because I've never actually seen anything of this DLC since it came out. Um... I've only heard about it anyway, because when I looked up the lore, they talked about the DLC, but I never actually played the DLC myself, so um, it's a shame, really. I watched, when, when Dawnguard came out, I played uh, Dawnguard uh, halfway through, and I watched the rest of it on video, but I never finished it, because that was the point at which I stopped playing Skyrim. Trespassing here. I strongly suggest you move along. Oh. Ho! Oh, you will pay for your crimes against the skull. Prepare to die. Ho, oh, I like this option. Thalmor to arms. Kill the intruder. Bitch, you don't know who you just messed with. Uthgood, take him down. Do look, look at look at Uthgood. Look at Uthgood shooting her arrows. Look at that. Wow. She's awesome. All right, look, let me let me stop running around now. Let me actually do something because I get, I get bored of this. I still have the crossbow from Dawn Guard. I like to use it because I put um, a health spell on it, which sucks health out of enemies. Oh, don't dodge my attack. It's l oh, you bitch. Go on, move. I dare you to move. There you go, bitch. Okay, what? Who is shooting me with lightning? Oh, there's a mage on the ship. Of course there would be. Of course there would be. You know what? 
let me get a potion of healing here and let me just go on there and murder him because I can do that. Uh, are you going to just stand there? Yeah, just just die for a moment while I go on the ship and uh, and do do my do my job. Oh wow, that that guy's actually a bit more powerful than I expected him to be. Um, you know what? Did you just resist my soul tear? Did you seriously just resist my soul tear? Bitch resisted my soul tear. How dare he? Oh no, wait. I was using. Oh fuck, I was using the dragon. Thing. Oh wow. Oh no, I used Bend Will. So that might have actually helped. Okay. Fair enough. I'm a bit new to that. Let's see. Oh, there was. I, I'm going to take that back. I want my Steel Bolt back, bitch. <laughs> I don't know where else I can get Steel Bolts, actually. I'm trying to figure that one out. Oh shit. I'm at 23 minutes. Um. Uh. You know what? I'm going to cut the video off here. And I'm going to, um, uh, you know, start a new video. So, uh, yeah, 23 minutes because I probably, yeah, probably cut quite a bit out. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll stop here. Okay. Um, let me just get these. You know, take all of that. Uh, thank you all for watching this video if you did. Uh, if you liked it, please leave a comment, I guess, because I always ask that. I don't know why. I just do. Uh, there's still a guy down here. Bitch. Just die already, okay? Just, just die. Did you, did you actually stop? Did he stop hitting me for a second? What the? F okay, you know what? I'm, I'm done with your shit. I am actually done with your shit. Here we, come here. Come here. There you go. You're done. You're dead. Fuck you. Okay. That's good. It's good. We're done. The job's done. Okay? Thank you guys for watching. Uh, and I will see you next time. Bye!